Don't miss the Green and Growing show in the noon to 9 p.m. hours on Eagle TV. Ellis County Horticulture agent Holly Dickman will identify common lawn and garden issues while providing up-to-date information. Watch weekdays in the noon to 9 p.m. hours on Channel 14 or 614. Green and Growing, brought to you by Riedel's Garden Center, a full-service garden center west of Hayes on Highway 40 and Eagle TV. With our current weather conditions, it takes a real expert to create landscape that'll thrive. Riedel's Garden Center has the staff with the expertise of water requirements for plants, lawns, and landscapes that'll stand up to our changing weather conditions. With 25 years of hands-on experience, owner Darren Riedel will customize a landscape design and irrigation system to meet your expectations and our climate. It's recommended to protect your lawn using Fertilone products available at Riedel's Garden Center, an authorized dealer. Call or stop by Riedel's Garden Center today. Tomatoes are one of those very popular vegetables that people like to grow in their garden and so this is the time of year that I'm starting to get some more questions about those. Unfortunately, it does take a little bit of time for you to see the fruits of your labor, especially when the temperatures are so hot in the summertime. But we are finally starting to see some tomatoes on our tomato plants here at the Ag Research Center and starting to finally pick some ripe ones. Um, this time of year, I do get questions about a few different tomato fruit issues, one of those being cracking. Uh, cracking is one of those things that happens a lot of times on tomato plants and you simply just can't control it sometimes. But what we do know is that tomato plants have a very fibrous root system that's very efficient at taking up moisture when it's available to the plant. And so when we have some periods of dry weather and then all of a sudden we have a big rainstorm where we have two or more inches of rain, that plant takes up a great deal of moisture during that time. And it's those fluctuations that can actually cause some of this sort of symptom of cracking. That tomato plant just takes up all the moisture and the fruit actually just expand faster than it can handle and so it will actually crack the skin. Now there are ways that you can help to control this to some extent. Um, one of those being cultural practices such as good mulch. A uh, mulch layer underneath the plants at least two to four inches thick will help reduce that big fluctuation of moisture loss. So when we have um, lots of evaporation due to hot winds and hot temperatures, that mulch will act as a blanket and actually hold that moisture into the soil longer. And on the other hand, it will also help uh, reduce weed competition and other things in your garden, which is very beneficial. This fluctuation in moisture, like I mentioned, is one of those things that causes some of these symptoms. So if you can water your plants on a regular basis, uh, make sure that they don't get extremely dry. Make sure that they're not getting mass amounts of moisture all at once. You know, don't let it completely dry out and then go back out and just water the heck out of it. Uh, try to be more regular with the watering. But like I said, with the weather being the way it's been, you can do everything right and still sometimes end up with these symptoms. Now, research has found that there are some varieties that are more resistant to cracking than others. And one of those is Jetstar, which is an old standard uh, tomato that many people have been growing for years and years. Unfortunately, Jetstar is one of those indeterminate plants that just continues to grow. So it gets really tall and rangy and large. And so if you have a small garden, you may not have much room or space for a plant like that but that is one tomato variety that shows more resistance to cracking symptoms. A couple of the other ones on the market are Sun Leaper or Floriana and there's a few others out there also that research has found are a little more resistant to cracking. They also have found that it's not necessarily the thickness of the skin but the pliability and so those varieties that I just mentioned have more pliable skin where if there is some fluctuations in moisture that skin can just handle it a little bit better. It doesn't crack under the pressure. If you have questions about tomato plants or the fruit of the tomato, maybe something's not quite looking just right, go ahead and contact your local Extension office for more information. Reporting for K-State Research and Extension, Eagle TV, I'm Holly Dickman, Ellis County Horticulture Extension Agent. Don't miss the Green and Growing show in the noon to 9 p.m. hours on Eagle TV. Ellis County Horticulture Agent Holly Dickman will identify common lawn and garden issues while providing up-to-date information. Watch weekdays in the noon to 9 p.m. hours on Channel 14 or 614. Green and Growing, brought to you by Riedel's Garden Center, a full-service garden center west of Hayes on Highway 40 and Eagle TV.
With our current weather conditions, it takes a real expert to create landscape that'll thrive. Riedel's Garden Center has the staff with the expertise of water requirements for plants, lawns, and landscapes that'll stand up to our changing weather conditions. With 25 years of hands-on experience, owner Darren Riedel will customize a landscape design and irrigation system to meet your expectations and our climate. It's recommended to protect your lawn using Fertilone products available at Riedel's Garden Center, an authorized dealer. Call or stop by Riedel's Garden Center today.